Hello everyone, how are you doing? My name is Martin and welcome back to another Let's Play episode of Kingdom Comes Deliverance and we continue where we left off so let's get right to it. We need to escape the castle and get to Red Eye and bury our parents and that will be the ending of the prologue and then finally we can start the real game. Am I hungry? Let's see, um, nourishment is 75. If we can eat that makes it exactly 100. At least it should do. Yes. So that's perfect. Okay. The hell is he doing? What? All right. Nobody's going to attack us. I've never seen that before. All right. So we don't have to, but we can steal a horse and then um, escape Tomberg and go to Red Eye. So I think we're going to do that. Still a little bit laggy here. But, um, I just today upgraded actually my PC with another 8 gig of internal RAM. So I've got 16 gigs of internal memory now. And I couldn't actually believe that the recommendations of this game to play it well are 16 gigs. I don't know any game from the top of my head that actually recommends that. So it's a bit crazy. but. Um, after the patch I had serious lag spikes that it made the game unplayable and I hope this fixes because I tried about everything that you can try in the book so well all right let's see put this in reverse um, if you don't know how you could escape I'll show you it's basically only one way and we jump off the bridge here I'll leave the FPS uh, on top of on the left top for this time, so I can give a little bit of an eye of what's going on. Because normally uh, it runs at 60 solid, but yeah. Oh, we had to talk to Sir Robert, but it doesn't really matter. Um, it could have increased my speech though, but it's okay. I think we should have be stopped by a guard. If not, that's fine. Alright, it just spiked to 7 FPS for some really weird reason. I don't know. Um, leg spikes I will cut out and we'll see what happens. Normally you get stopped actually here by a guard and you have to persuade them. But um, apparently because I didn't talk to Sir Robert, I didn't have to do that. So we're going to ride to a little bit and we get to a cutscene. It won't take too long. Me here, friend. Better to keep going on my own. Running without a saddle is pretty good. It's like they've already gone. That was pretty nasty, man. Whew. Let's get out of here and find our parents. And I believe that we'll encounter some company here. So I nicked the bow. It's pretty good. Good. Come in handy because there will be a few bandits. And there's one right over here. Let's see if you can shoot him. Oh, 
<laughs> in his nuts. Oh. There you go. Ooh, almost out of uh, breath as well. Take a sword. It's, it's a six. It's not so good. But. And I didn't damage too much. We'll leave this. Take my arrows. And basically that's our first upgrade. So let's have a look. The sword. And take this. This one is pretty okay. That seems better. Um, throw away these shoes. So I don't really need them. And this is also good. Yeah. And it's worth 18. For now it's fine. Later on I will never take that with me again. But okay. Right. Let's keep trucking. I'm not going to loot all these corpses. Because it's rare that they have uh, anything like maybe one groschen with them. And some food. And I don't really need food. So I'm going to just skip it. And go straight to skeletons. Because we're not in Skellis yet. Can I have a look at the map? No, we're in Rovna. So we have to do a little bit of a walk. And see what we come across. Um, there should be another bandit a little bit up ahead. We'll do some flower picking though. No, not these ones though. I'd like to increase my strength a little bit more. And that one perk, that helps. That helps not so much, but if you're close to leveling up your strength, then it's not too bad. Uh, every time you pick up a flower, a flower, a bunch of flowers, herbs, um, you get a 1 XP. Uh, doesn't sound like much, but eventually it adds on. And let's say you need 20 more XP. Yeah, man. It's this guy, isn't it? Let's say you need 20 more XP than picking up 20 herbs done pretty quickly, so... Oh no, it's not too bad. Alright, so we're close to Ratai. And I believe there in the distance by the fence there should be another bandit. Did anyone do this? What did these poor souls ever do to Ooh, them? We can pick these. A little bit of extra money, always good. Oh man, the weather is so bad. No thunder, the thunder is pretty good in this game, especially the sound. Alright, so there should be... Hang on. Can't resist picking a few more. Should be guy right over here. It's hard to see, but you will. Oh yeah, I can see. Him. There you go. And I think I got him in his leg. Ooh, that was the first. <laughs> what did he have? An axe. I'll take that. Probably not going to use it. I like to use um, a mace in this game. Yeah. yeah. Mace and board, probably. That's the way I think I'm going for. Alright, we have some extra upgrades. So let's have a look. Um, hunter gloves are pretty good. And this one... It doesn't really matter. The other one has a little bit more durability. That one's pretty good as well. That one's really good. Um, take that for extra armor. Uh, this one... I don't... It's less noisy. I haven't still decided if I want to go full stealth or not. I'm probably going to make two suits, two outfits. And I wish they put something in the game where you can store outfits. Um, <coughs> but I, I have one way to do that. In, in Toward and do that. Oh. I'm talking about... <laughs> Alright. Enough babbling. Let's continue. Um... Should be one more bandit. If you wonder how I know this, uh, I've played this game for already 120 hours. So yeah, I <laughs> really do love this game. This is my new Skyrim, so to say. Damn, did I play Skyrim a lot. I wanted to get back to Skyrim. Um, 
is to put the survival in, but it's not challenging enough. So, and I tried a few things, but I couldn't come up with something really good. All right, next bend is up ahead. Oh, that lightning man, that's nice. All right, cool. Got my arrows. Let's see. I think I missed them, but that's okay. Oh, that one, uh, that was good. So in the wrong place, at the wrong time. Got him again. One more. Perfect. Oh, nice. Main level up. Uh, let's do that right away. Um, and strength as well. So let's see for this one. Is there already... Mm, let's see. They're not all that good. No. No. I think I'll take scout for now. It's not fantastic, but that's okay. And for strength, I'm going to do the clinch master. Uh, that will definitely come in handy. And we have a main level one. Um, I thought, oh, I had two main levels. All right. Let's see. I think I'm going to keep it for now. Yeah. Yeah, let's keep it for now. We did the other one. I don't want that, but we might have some body armor. This is worth quite a bit. So take that. And. Alright, that's pretty cool. Let's see. If there's any upgrade for us. And uh, not really. This one. Was that. Oh. Was that actually an upgrade? Hang on. Uh, this one is good. Although it needs to be repaired. And let's see. Take that. It's pretty okay. Um, yeah. A little bit less noisy. And then we keep the rest. Carry weight is. We're about full, but it's okay. Alright. 19 arrows. Got a few of these. Okay, we should be good. Let's go. Um, this is, I believe, the only entrance. And I believe there should be a sword. The bailiff should be around here. Bailiff. Yeah. He Look, here it is. The guy with the sword in his hand. All right. Take his groschen. And I'm not going to loot all the other corpses because there's not much use to it. So, used to but the the to you. in the end, you were a hero. <laughs> you didn't run away. You didn't abandon like me. One of the Germans. And there's our love. No, no, no. Why? Damn girl. Not you. Just wait a moment. I can use the ring. And then I'll come back for you. There you go. I won't leave you like this. <coughs> so pretty sad, man. So, yeah. Okay. Cutscene time. face. 
I'll find him. First, I have to find the shovel and I'll take care of you. I remember you told me you wanted to lie beside Mother. Here. Under the linden tree. At least I can do that much for you. Sad man. Damn. All right, so you can hear a duck barking. Get away, you mutt. Get away, you beast. What's going on? Mishak? What in God's name are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? Digging turnips? The beast just went for me. You not mock the butchers. Isn't that body the butchers? Yeah, that's him. What's that got to do with anything? Well, he's not the brightest light, is he? I'd say the poor creature is standing guard over his master. You weren't trying to get to him, were you? What do you care what I'm doing? What are you doing? Came to bury my parents. You shall bury them and leave me. Did you know what happened to Teresa? You know? When I fled, the Cumans wanted to... They meant to violate her. God knows what else. No, I don't know. What do I care? They probably raped her and killed her like all the others. Her misfortune. Right now, I've got to take care of myself. How did you manage to get away? How do you think I ran? Did you lend me that spade? I have to dig a grave. I can't find another. What's it worth? I see you have a fine sword. He's a fucking How bastard. How you my spade for that? How did you come by it anyway? Fine. I'll take the spade and you can have the sword. You can have it right up your ass. You think you can talk that way just because you've got a sword? You're bullshit. I don't know much about I think sword so. fighting. Suits me. I'll knock your teeth in then. Ooh, let's go. Yeah, I've got a perk, dude. No. <laughs> I don't think you can tackle, which is bullshit. But he will escape anyway, I'm pretty sure he will. Alright, let's get the spade. Uh, poor mud. Let me loot your, your master. There you go. Ooh, that weather. Alright. Well, we have to dig the grave. Yeah. Fun. Under the linden tree. So let's do that. That's a real proper slaughter, man. Jesus. All right, let's go. Armory's gone. I mean, there's not much left. All right. Uh, 
should get a prompt somewhere. No? Why? It's not bugged, is it? Please. Um. All right, so I replayed to up to here. Hopefully, it works now. There we go. Oh, thank God. Damn it all. How am I going to do this? Do you need some help? See the sword. Who are you? What do you want? Spishek? Who do you think we are? Franciscan brothers? <laughs> We're to rob you of everything you've got. Especially that fine blade that's of no use to a peasant like you anyway. Banish the thought. It is my father's sword. You mean him? I don't think he's going to be needing it. Listen here, boy. You hand over that sword. I might just let you go. If not, you're in for a family reunion you really don't want. Leave me alone. Kill him, Runt! I cut the bastard down. As you like. I'm going to try something, but it probably won't work. But if I make it, I'm going to try to get to the sheep range. Let me switch on the camera. Hi. <laughs> Um, this is where the combat area is. If he hit us once, that's it. But I never try this, and I like to at least hit him once. Where the fuck is he? Oh, there he is. Oh shit! <laughs> well, I could could give it a try, didn't I? Well, I'm back here. <laughs> I told you how it would end. You should have listened to me. This is nice work. 
Chief is going to like it. <laughs> it's new, isn't it? <sighs> now, for the maiden bloodletting. <sighs> Surely your father never would have imagined it would be your blood. <sighs> I believe there's a word for such moments. <laughs> The old man would certainly know. But I'm just a common killer. Did you help make it? No doubt you did. Such miserable luck. To die by the sword you helped forge. Hey, go fuckers! And we go from 20 FPS to 60. Sure. Oh, we have a bad dream. It's not over yet, guys. It's not over yet. All right, we have to run to the A, and I think there's some weird fighting going on. There's another thing I like to test here. The enemies you can kill, they drop something, so... At least one of them did. Look. Actually pick it up. I'm really curious if we have that in our inventory once we're done here, so let's give it a try. Do you need some help?
work to be done. Wake up, Henry. It's past sunrise. Henry, can you hear me? Get up, Henry. Wake up. It's a new day. Henry, can you hear me? Hallelujah. I thought you'd never wake. Were you having a nightmare? Uh, Teresa? Hmm. I still have a fever. Uncle won't be pleased, but you'll have to stay in bed. Where am I? In Scalitz? We're at my uncle's mill in Rattay. I didn't know where else to go. What happened? You don't remember anything? I suppose that's not surprising. I found you in Scalitz after those bandits attacked you. I thought they'd done for you. But you were still breathing. Why in heaven's name did you go back there? It was madness. They slaughtered everyone who didn't run. My parents, I... I wanted to bury them. I had to... Don't worry. I took care of it. Thank you. Any good Christian would have done the same. Now sleep. You need your strength back. <laughs> A few delirious days later. You're awake. Good morning. <laughs> it's near midnight. You've slept all day. Oh. <coughs> oh, I feel like a horse fell on me. The beating you took was worse. But at least the fever's broken. How did you manage to save me? You were lucky. I was in Scalitz and I saw Zbyshek and his thugs. I tried to distract them, but it would have been no use if those soldiers from Tamburg hadn't arrived. They were searching for you and scattered the bandits. What in the world were you doing in Scalitz? Waiting to die. What? They killed my brothers, my family, my friends. They're all dead? All of them. Everyone I ever loved. They killed one of my brothers in the mines. After that, what did I have to live for? Don't say that. There's always hope. No, there isn't. But it doesn't matter. I'm a different person now. Searching for me? Yes. Lord Divish sent them, led by Captain Robard. So tell me, why is a lord of such high standing interested in a blacksmith? So Divish promised Sir Radic he'd look after me. But as for why they should care... Oh, I'm exhausted. I'm not surprised. I'll bring you water and something to eat. In the meantime, rest. You're still very weak. And even later... Good morning to you. How's the invalid today? Oh, I haven't felt as good as this since they lashed me to the wheel and quartered me on the town square. Got your sense of humour back. You must be better. My uncle will be glad to hear it. I had a job persuading him to let me bring you here. If you'd lain around much longer, he really would have dumped you on the town square. You can stay until you find somewhere else to live, but my uncle will want payment for taking you in and caring for you. And this is your uncle's house? We're in Rattay Mill, my uncle's miller Peshek. He took me in, and I talked him into taking care of you too. I've been lying here long enough. Uncle will be pleased he's one mouth less to feed. But are you truly well enough? Well enough to do what has to be done. Where can I find Sir Radzig? He's in the lower castle in Perkstein. He's a guest of Sir Hannes of Leiper. But someone like you can't just walk up bold as you please and demand an audience. I know Sir Radzig. And I didn't bring him his sword as I was supposed to. I must see him. If you insist. But you need to speak to my uncle first. You've been in your sickbed for over a fortnight while he paid the apothecary to tend to you, and for medicine. That's a good deal of a coin you owe him. I've been lying here two weeks. My God. Better a fortnight in bed than an eternity in the grave. If it weren't for my uncle, you wouldn't be here at all. I owe you both my life. And I'll repay my debt. You have my word. All right. But before you go to town, you should eat something. You're still weak. There's food on the table for you. Yeah, the pancakes. 
I love pancakes. There we go. Have some of these, and then let's see. Take some of these nums. All right, how are we doing on nourishment? Not too bad actually. So let's have a few pancakes. And take another one. That's perfect. Now one of the beds should be able to save. I think this one doesn't, but this one does. This is a new feature. It's pretty good. So let's do that. I do think it uses savory snaps though. Well, I'm cool with that. Some people don't like the system. I'm okay with that. It's not so hard to make the potion, so should be good. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Game is saved. I uh, hope you enjoyed this one. That's the prologue over, and we really can start the game. So join me for the next episode. Until then, have a great day. I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.